it was going to be safe for our players. I knew that I could, I could drink and not pop a drug test or do anything like that. So I knew from the get-go that this stuff was going to be okay to drink. So for me, I put it in my little refrigerator in my office, and I drank it every day like you told me to, two months in the morning, two months before I go on the field, and I drank it every day. You know, shake it up, keep it chill, did all that stuff. About a few weeks into it, I started feeling pretty good. You know, Mike was trying to tell me, you know, how I was going to feel, and I really, really didn't want to hear it because I'm a very big skeptic um, about anything. We can, we can try anything for free. I can get EAS products for free. I can take any Gatorade product for free. Uh, you name it, any kind of nutritional drink, we get it for free. So, to buy something, I wasn't really into that. That, that, uh, that wasn't my mode. If it was free, it was for me. That's how I looked at it. So, um... I started drinking, I started feeling good. Um, not to be, you know, I, I've had a lot of problems through playing baseball. Uh, I had C4, C5 in my neck, uh, which was basically bulging disc. I had three shoulder surgeries, I had an elbow surgery, um, knee surgery, everything pretty much on my right side, pretty well banged up. Not to the point of where I would hurt every day, but just, you know, just annoying pains and stuff like that. You just kind of get sick of it. Anyway, so I started drinking this uh, Mono V, and it started feeling really good. Uh, we have a team chiropractor, so I go see him on a regular basis. And his name is Dr. Prieto, and about three weeks into this, he's telling me how my neck's feeling, just because he's used to how, how, how it moves and maneuvers and all that stuff. He's telling me I felt a lot more lubricated, and for me, that kind of meant something. But I, I really didn't know what was in the juice. I just did it with juice, it was good for me, I was going to drink it. He asked me if, if there was glucosamine in it, and I had no idea at the time. I was drinking the active, the green bottle. And so I called my wife and told her about it, and that was on a Monday. I told Dr. Creator on a Friday that there was glucosamine in the juice. Do you think that it had that kind of an effect on my, on my neck? And uh, he, he, he told me yes. So, this day, he started, you know, believing in it as well. He, he's now a drinker as well. But, uh, you know, I started feeling better. My shoulders started feeling better right away. My elbows started feeling better. And it might not mean a lot to you guys, but I mean, I have to throw every single day. I have a, uh, a it's called significant tear in my own collateral ligament, which is about three-quarters of the way torn. A lot of people can't even throw it. I, I can throw batting practice every day. It doesn't bother me. Um, my knee never really bothered me that much after I had surgery on it, so it, it still feels good. But um, the rest of my body feels good. The biggest thing I've noticed this year in spring training is my feet usually hurt. Uh, just walking around in weird shoes all the time and just uh, standing around when you're on the field all day. Basically from 6 a.m. until I just got here. So our game was over at 4.30 today. Did you win? Yeah, we, we beat the Giants. So. Oh! <laughs> and we also beat the Diamondbacks the other day, too. So we had no way. Look at this. Press it up. Push it up, baby. Push it. Can't wait. So, uh, anyways, I, I feel great on this. Uh, and for me, um, kind of why we're here, uh, because of Keith and Amy, is I started feeling so good on Mono V that, you know, every year for, you know, your New, year, New Year's resolution, you always say, hey, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do something. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start working out. I'm going to lose a little weight. I'm going to start feeling good about myself. I'm going to change all these things. You just wake up. You do it for a couple weeks, and then that's boom, it's over. Okay? Well, I started drinking my IV in July, late July, and in November I got here, and I was like, you know what, I'm going to go down to see Keith Pool's gym. He was at a different place at the time. Started talking to Keith, got interested in uh, working out again because my body started feeling good, and worked out here for about three months, and the reason why I'm saying this is because my IV for me, is, is a, for me, it was a lifestyle change. It made me think of, you know what, if you feel good, you might as well start working out. It had been 10 years I've been saying that I was going to work out. 10 years, I didn't realize, I, mean, I stopped playing in 1999, and in 2009, I decided, you know, it's about time I started working out. 